solve and verify that your result satisfies the equation. The equation that we're given is 25 and 17 hundredths equals x minus 16 and 59 hundredths. So to solve an equation, we want our variable, in this case is x, all by itself on one side of the equation equal to a specific value. And that value that it's equal to is what's going to make this a true statement when you plug it in for the variable x. So we look, and x is on the right side of the equation, and we've subtracted 16 and 59 hundredths from x. We want to undo that subtraction, and the way we undo that subtraction is through addition, because addition is the inverse of subtraction. So we're going to add 16 and 59 hundredths to the right side of the equation. But remember, whatever we do to the right side, we have to do to the left side of the equation so that things stay equal. It remains an equation. So we will add those, and when we add negative 16 and 59 hundredths and positive 16 and 59 hundredths, those will go away. They become zero, and we have x all by itself on the right-hand side of the equation. On the left-hand side, we're going to add 25 and 17 hundredths and 16 and 59 hundredths. And we will get 41 and 76 hundredths. But that is our solution to our equation. Now we want to verify that our results of 41 and 76 hundredths actually satisfies the equation. In order to do that, we'll take the original equation, 25 and 17 hundredths equals x minus 16 and 59 hundredths. And instead of x, now we'll substitute in that solution we got. Just to verify that when we do that, we will get a true statement. The two sides will actually be equal to one another. So 41 and 76 hundredths minus 16 and 59 hundredths gives us 25 and 17 hundredths. So we have 25 and 17 hundredths equals 25 and 17 hundredths, which checks. So we have verified our solution to the equation.